What's up everybody, it's your boy JMO Giants, and today I'm coming up to the best build in NBA 2K20. It is a Curry, Gilbert Arenas, and Kyrie build, as you guys can tell by the title. I'm going to show you guys some clips, and enjoy. Okay, so you're going to start making your player, and then you're going to choose the pie chart that is mostly playmaking and shooting, which is this pie chart right here. Okay, then you're going to want to choose the uh, pie chart that is mostly based on speed, which is the first one. Okay, so now you're going to max out almost all of your finishing badges. You're going to leave standing dunk and post hook untouched. Max out your shooting, max out your playmaking, upgrade perimeter defense, lateral quickness, and steal. And I forgot to say this, but at the end, put the rest of your attributes into block. Okay, now this doesn't matter, I personally like to find. I'm gonna make them 6-4. I'm going to make them least weight, as so fast as possible. Least wingspan, so you got my 89 ball control and an 88 three point shot. And I personally like to make take over. So as you can see, when you pick playmaker takeover, you're going to get an offensive threat based on Gilbert Arena, Kyrie Irving, and Stephen Curry. So this is just a picture of what the final stat should look like with your wingspan, your weight, and all that. So just base everything off of this, and I'm going to go over the badges right now. So even though you only have four potential upgrades for finishing, the most important badges are Contact, Giant Slayer, Relentless, and Slithery. You can either get Slithery or Acrobat. I recommend Slithery. So shooting badges are very important on this build. Obviously, you're a shooter slash playmaker. This is what I would go with, personally. I think Hall of Fame Deep Range, Hall of Fame Range, and Hall of Fame Difficult are required. Quick Draw, usually I would go Hall of Fame, but... You don't really have that much, so I think it's worth it to get Silver Catch and Shoot and Silver Quick Draw. Or you can just get Quick Draw Hall of Fame or Just Catch Shoot Hall of Fame. It's up to you if you want your jump shot to be fast. But Flexible Release and Steady Shooter, you need gold. Those are clutch, 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 especially for not like pure sharp. They are clutch badges to have. And playmaking badges obviously are important also, as you are a playmaking sharp, basically. So gold ankle breaker, gold downhill, gold space crater, gold tight handles, and gold unpluckable. Very effective badges, all are good for obviously getting faster, getting open, being able to break people, not losing the ball, creating space, it's all very good. Quick first step right now is the best badge in the game in my opinion, and handles for days is a must for those of you who have it for a hall of fame. And for defense I don't have a screenshot of this, but I personally choose Intimidator honestly up to you and now that i've shown you guys the best point guard build in nba 2k20 based like steph curry kyrie irving and gilbert arena make sure you leave a like tell me in the comments if you guys like the 2k20 demo these are just some clips that i got with some other characters tested out i've so far went through three different accounts so i've went through 18 builds on nba 2k20 just to look for this for you guys so i know it's good Make sure you subscribe, hit the like button, show some love, and thank you guys for all the support.